In opening our Oracle Max application in the Design Editor, we will first navigate from the main list view page showing all the employees in our phone book down to the details page where we have two tabs for showing the employees details including their location. It's this last tab where we'd like to add a map to show the employees address. As the employees detail tab doesn't have that much room to view a map and ideally we'd want to use as much screen real estate to do this as possible, we'll place the map exclusively on the locations tab. On clicking the location tab, we can then drag in a map from the components palette. On selecting the properties option, we can change the two options like best fit for the available points for when we have multiple points to display on the map, or center on the location, which is suitable for just displaying one point. As we're going to show the employer's location only, the second option is for us. We'll now bind the map to the employer's location. On switching to the data tab, we see our first choice is to choose are we plotting a map with multiple or single points. We'll take single for the current employee. Next, we'll map this to our employee object. For the location value for the map, we can either drop a geolocation of the employee, that is a comma separated latitude or longitude, or a single address formatted field. Now, conveniently, the data source we've built provides a formatted address field. But if we wanted to, we could copy the address fields in one by one, but we'll use the formatted address for now. So on returning to the preview mode, straight away we can see the outcome with the employee's location plotted for us to see on the new map.